This is an ABC 10 News update. Good evening, I'm Kimberly Hunt in the ABC 10 News studio. Tomorrow, San Diego County will find out if it will fall into the state's most restrictive COVID-19 level. That is the dreaded purple tier. And that would happen if our local case rate remains above seven per 100,000 people. Here's a look at the latest local numbers. 401 new cases were reported today, bringing our total to more than 60,000. No new deaths reported. In total, 908 San Diegans have died. We know the name of the man shot to death in Ramona last week. The killer is still on the run. The Sheriff's Department says 46-year-old Mario Cardozo died from a gunshot wound after someone found him on the ground in front of a home. It happened early Thursday morning on Pine Street. Detectives call it a murder and they're asking anyone with information about the shooter to call Crime Stoppers. Caltrans is considering a change that would affect your wallet. Instead of funding road repairs through gas tax, it wants to charge drivers based on how many miles they drive. Caltrans says it's a response to more vehicles becoming fuel efficient and it's looking for 150 volunteers to test usage based insurance and pay at the pump for vehicle charging stations. It also plans to test out app based payments uh, for miles driven and vehicle data collection. Anyone interested can sign up at caroad charge.com.